early on in the sequence. Here goes the Boeing F-80 Super Hornet. to increase fuel capacity, more powerful engines, and they aim to reduce the aircraft's radar cross-section by up to 50%, and flight tests of some of these enhancements began only last August.
maneuvers to fly where the aircraft is going in one direction but the nose is pointing 30 degrees higher. Uh, so the view over the nose is quite different, uh, uh, quite difficult, uh, but very useful in air combat uh, to be able to pull that alpha to get the nose off to another aircraft and bring a weapon to bear. Well, there a contribution from the Boeing company, long-time supporters of the Air Tattoo. The same is true of the company providing the next display item, namely Airbus. Here we see an aeroplane that will become a very familiar sight in the sea sky in the, this part of the world. From, in fact, September this year, when the first one will be delivered to the Royal Air Force. Perhaps surprise Norton, more about it in a bit. This first, 